right, officially, sir, let's meet you first and foremost, sir. I'm Professor Michael Semidili Odimayo, the Special Advisor to the Governor on Health. Nice meeting you in your office here in Akura, the capital city of Ondo State. Sir, the trending disease in Nigeria right now, which is cholera, everybody's talking about it. But bringing it down to Ondo State, uh, what is your take on this first and foremost, sir? Well, the cholera issue, as far as Ondo State is concerned, there is no case reported yet. Right. But uh, we have stepped up surveillance activities. Across the border, within the state, everybody is on red alert to be sure if we have any case, such is identified and promptly reported. And the various management method has also been re-exercised or uh, renewed so that our people right. can be well prepared, they are well prepared to be able to mitigate any occurrence. All right, sir. Quickly, how are you sensitizing the people of Ondo State on this right Currently, now? Currently, there is hiring uh, health education activities going on. We are doing that right now, teaching the people, encouraging them. Our surveillance is there that we will see if anybody has a case of vomiting or diarrhea, they should promptly take such a person to the nearest health facility. And then at the nearest health facility, proper care will be given and then reporting will be appropriately done. So those activities have also been educating our people on the importance of safe intake of water and food. Right. We have told our people about why it is important for them to be sure that we have a drink safe water. Uh, use of toilets appropriately. We should use toilets, appropriate toilets. Uh, that should be used and an adequate washing of hands, total washing of hands. We have already educated our people and we are reminding them that you must wash your hands adequately before food, after food, when you are coming into the house. If you want to take your fruit or vegetable, you must make sure you properly wash it, you wash it thoroughly. And we have also encouraged our people on good sanitation, very, very important. At this time, we're encouraging our people, if you can avoid eating outside, do. Eat right. food that you prepare, that you show you have hygienically prepared. But if I want to eat outside, be sure you eat food that is hot uh, or the one that is heated up again. And we have encouraged our various food vendors to be sure that appropriate hygienic activities is carried out in the preparation of the food right so that we can be sure that our people are safe from this epidemic right sir uh, ondo state as a state is really trending right now in some things for instance in health healthcare is very um adequate or let me just say prominent in ondo state right now so but moving forward sir do we have designated uh, centers for cholera disease uh, treatments right now yeah, you know that the governor, Governor Loki Olivier Yeda Tiwa, is a person that sounds about the health of the people right. and the welfare of the people. So he has already given the marching order to be sure that nobody dies of cholera in the state. In short, we are, we are sure that from the border to the innermost part of the city, right. all our healthcare workers, they are well prepared to take, make sure they take care of uh, cholera cases or any other cases of disease for that matter. Okay. So we have not designated any special center for that. For any Every treatment. Every of our health facility is ready to take care of cholera cases. And where there is need for referral, they will be referred along the, from primary to secondary and tertiary level. Okay. But our people are well prepared to take care of cases. Okay, moving, moving, shifting away from cholera right now. Let's take a look at healthcare, um, healthcare in Ondo State. What do you have to tell the world about this, sir? Yeah, Ondo State is having it good at this time in terms of health. Starting from the tertiary health system, we have fantastically improved healthcare services across board from the teaching hospital to the specialist centers, we have our staff that are well prepared to work for the health of the people. We have the system well prepared because the governor has already 
motivated the people. The people who are taking care of the health of, the, uh, of our citizens, they are happy. They are taking the system as their personal system to be sure. So you have stakeholder engagement and involvement in the healthcare system of Ondo State. So the people are prepared. Our health system is getting much better. And we are challenging, giving, bringing up the necessary challenges that is needed for the various leaders at the various levels of the health sector in Ondo State. And we are getting appropriate response. And indeed, our state is doing better, far, far better now than much ever. All right, sir. In one word, would you say that um, healthcare is very, very expensive in Ondo State right now? Expensive? Well, the, the health care system itself, in the least sense, is an expensive system. Right. But by virtue of the way the government is doing it, we have made this simplified for the people. So it's extremely cheap. We have over 198 LOLs in the contributory health scheme wow. in the states that are enjoying free health services. And more, all, virtually all the in, informal sector are being in the process of being brought in into the into the contributory health scheme even though naturally health is expected to be expensive the way the government under the leadership of governor lucky is taking health in this state is making it available and affordable for the generality of the people okay sir taking it to the interiors how prominent and how efficient is that we have our health posts our health facilities in in all worlds in virtual and so many of the units across the state so our health facilities they are available we're also encouraging the private health facilities they are doing fantastically well they are packaged into the we're giving them all the necessary encouragement to be able to function to meet the head of our uh, head of our people so it's, it's a good time for everybody wow this is an interesting interview we view the essay on health matters in Ondo state uh, honorable Odimayo. We're so glad that we came here to take this interview in Ondo State. Uh, but lastly, sir, what is your message to people of Ondo State on health? Yes, on health I want matters? to tell the people of Ondo State, you have a responsible leader in Ondo State. So make sure you are responsible. Take to what you are expected to do and do it so that we can jointly work together for the health of the generality of us all. Wow. Thank, Thank you. you so much for take, uh, granting this interview to FOSA TV channel. The world will hear about this. Thank you so much, sir. <laughs>